hi guys thanks so much for coming back to my channel um, mama and I we went shopping at Costco today Kirkland's and Walmart and I think the house is fully stocked with groceries now <laughs> so this is kind of like not a mod podge of a haul but just some things that I couldn't get at Aldi or of course at Costco and or I needed to get that I didn't get yesterday because I did go in there to get oh let me get them these little well, I didn't go in there for this. I went in there to get some oil for my car and some, I think we needed some soap, some tops, some scrubbing bubbles. I did pick up some Tylex yesterday and some soap. So I like that winter. If you guys seen that Dove Winter Relief, I think that's what it's called, Winter Relief Soap. And it's really pricey though. It's like $6 and then I got some dial soap. So that's what I picked up yesterday. But I needed to go back because the boys were kind of rushing me. We picked trail up from the train station. And um, it was like raining like cats and dogs. And I was just ready to go home. Okay, so yesterday I picked up the meal prep containers. And I was actually looking for these. But all they had was in the big containers. The big quantity of... So it was like a total of... 30 but I think that's like 15 lids I could be wrong but I want to say it is and 15 bottoms so I picked these up today and they were like two dollars and some change these are really must be really going really must be really 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 these must be really popular at Walmart right now because when they first put them out like around Christmas time they had a ton of them and now I don't hardly see them at all so this one does not have like a section in the middle and I think these cost a little bit more you get five in these and these this one has a divider in the middle so I'm gonna food prep my food and usually when I'm doing something my husband wants to do it too and so I said I'll go ahead and food prep his food too and so then we'll already have some we do have some containers i got from roses if you guys seen that haul but they're really they're okay to use for a couple times but not a lot because there's like a really thin plastic okay guys so i also picked up the rubbermaid fresh works produce saver i was looking at this this is the bonus pack and i'm like where are the bonuses i mean it says it on there but they're counting the lids and the top and you get four containers and I bought a lot of fruit and produce and stuff and I need to prep that tomorrow well a lot of lettuce I should say a lot of lettuce and stuff and I need to prep it up tomorrow and put it in these containers wash it off and everything so I picked this up this was like you might as well round it off to $23 for those and then I did pick up this one here the Rubbermaid Fresh Works in this size container and I thought this would be great for grapes. And this was the only one. So this was like $12 or $13. I had to look at the receipt and caption it. But it was $12 and something. And so was this one. So usually I have like two things of salad. So that's why I um, like the romaine. And then I like to get the mixed greens. I think that's what it's called. The mixed kind. So it has this little thing down reservoir down here. So it doesn't sit in its water. And it stays fresh longer. So that was about $13. Then I picked up some paper. I wanted the cheapest, not the cheapest, but I wanted the cheaper paper. And they didn't have it. So I think it's like 30 cents cheaper. So my mom was laughing at me because I was like, I'm being really cheap. Um, I did kind of splurge, not splurge on these fresh works, but it's saving you money in the long run because you're not wasting your produce. Okay, so then I picked up the Cranberry Grape Diet. Mama was looking for a light. I think it's this grape peach. She said it's great value she likes. I think that's what it is. And I saw this diet on the top shelf. It was on the very top shelf. It was $148, and I got the cranberry. And I was like, oh, I like that. So I did pick this up before, and I like it. It's really great, especially if you have boys. I know it says pet urine, but it's really great to spray. I know I'm always, every single time I go in the bathroom, guys, I have to use the um, Tylex Clorox cleaner. And, of course, I have to be careful not to spray too much. But I'm spraying the toilet, wiping the toilet down every single time I have to go in because I have boys. But mainly it's Josiah. So um, the other ones are sort of trained, but they still, you know, they're boys. Okay, so then, um, and this kind of knocks the smell out 
other than using bleach all of the time. So also I um, picked up the Festi Cherry. I was out of this. And then the Strawberry um, Gava. And the blue, Icea, Ikea Berry, I think that's what it's called. Mama said it's really good, but I'm scared to try it. So I know sometimes on the aisle, Walmart will have like an individual can. So I need to try the individual can for like 50 cents. These were 350 and I don't remember how much this was, guys. I want to say three something. Um, I picked up some great tomatoes. And then I just picked up like some vegetables to stock up on. Some peas and carrots. The steamable bag. It was like 57 cents. The kernel corn, 57 cents. Mixed vegetables. Usually I buy in twos, but I only bought in ones today. The sweet peas, the cut green beans, and the chopped spinach. So I believe all of it. The chop spinach may have been 97 cents, but everything else was 57. I picked up some Idaho and potatoes, and I haven't tried, but I've seen the recipe forever, like the crock pot, the potatoes cooking, cooking the baked potatoes in a crock pot. So I want to try them in my cassori, but I don't mind just putting them in the oven as long as I plan it ahead of time. And these were 348, the Walmart brand. They look like they might go bad soon, so I didn't get those. They were a little small. I needed another cabbage because the one at Aldi was kind of small. And um, they will eat that really fast because Jason, not Jason. Well, Jason does eat cabbage, but Trail's home and Trail likes cabbage. So I also picked up some grape jelly. They go through that really quick. I didn't want to get it at um, Costco because it's such a large container. But last, you know what? I didn't even look. This is the same day. So I try to put these in order as how we went shopping. And then, guys, you did let me know about the Bada um, Complete Seasoning. This was $1.98. I wasn't sure if I got it from Dollar Tree. If you saw that Dollar Tree haul, it's a smaller quantity, smaller bottle. And I love this stuff. This stuff is really good. Like, if you have, like, some steamed broccoli, it's a no-salt seasoning. It's only $1.98 at Walmart, so I was happy that they had it because I didn't want to have to keep going to Dollar Tree, hunting it down, buying a bunch of bottles, just in case I don't know if they carry it all the time because this will be like a staple now. So um, it has like a ton of different seasonings in it. Herbs look like garlic, onion, is that basil in it, and I really like it. It's really good if you have like something that's bland, like some of these frozen vegetables and you don't want to put salt on it this is good for it okay i also picked up some paint brushes i'm about to do a project and i'll share with you guys when i do that project and then i did pick up because mama was with me she was kind of telling me which ones were the best coffee to get and so i always get donut shot but she was saying breakfast blend was a little bit milder and that might be best for me so i did pick up this and was like 398 the paint brushes guys one's like 128 and one might be two something. So normally I get my paint brushes from Dollar Tree, but the little strings do come out. They do come out. So usually when I get them from Walmart, I try to make sure I clean them off so they don't get hard and stuff. But um, yeah. But I heard about the hack where you put it in a bag and put it in the refrigerator or something like that. But usually I just put it in a paper cup and let it soak in that, and then I'll take it out and then I'll rinse it and let it air dry. Okay, so then, um, I think Mama said she's seen this in Grady's mom's haul, and she wanted to try. She couldn't remember which one. So, they were $5, and I thought I would try it. Let's see. This is a Spicy Sizzler flatbread, and I could pair this with the, I can cut this and, you know, cut it in slices for the boys, and then add, like, a salad to it, because we have tons of salad. And then this is the pepperoni with the mozzarella. You get, like, the big mozzarella whole mozzarella here and then this is like chicken so they did have like a chicken and bacon one and I don't remember what the other ones were but all the other three were bacon and this was the only one with like um with just like pepperoni and cheese so that for five dollars Sia saw these Paw Patrol boys athletic boxer boxer briefs he loves to strip as soon as he gets home and he saw these and I said, I've been wanting to pick him up some like this and he saw them. These were eight something. I know my boys, I don't know about JJ, but I know Trail and my husband love like these kind of 
compression light briefs or whatever they love them so i thought this was cute i saw them a while back but when he picked them up today i said i'd go ahead he loves to strip and hardly wear anything most of the time in the house and then he likes to um he changes his clothes like 10 times a day which is ridiculous and then i bought a nightgown guys and i got a black and pink one yesterday this is the secret treasures and it was $14 I needed some nightgowns like really bad I had some lounge clothes and stuff but I didn't have like some gowns I like to sleep in a gown and yeah so it was like $14 yep so that's what that looks like and it was kind of long because we like the short ones but you don't it's not long long but it's long for us because we're like five one five three so that's it guys i got from walmart i hope you guys enjoyed this haul don't forget to like comment subscribe and i hope you guys have a great day or evening when you see this bye bye